Buffalo Bill Reservoir near Cody is known statewide by anglers for its rainbow and Yellowstone cutthroat trout. But an increase in the population of lake trout, coupled with an illegal introduction of walleye in that reservoir, has fisheries biologists with the Wyoming Game and Fish Department concerned the rainbow and cutthroat trout in the reservoir could be overrun. The Game and Fish with researchers from Colorado State University have been conducting intensive sampling of the reservoir to study the diets of the walleye and lake trout and estimate populations of all the fish species there. The objective is understanding the degree to which lake trout and walleye are impacting the rainbows and cuts. Cody Region Fisheries Biologist Jason Burkhart. Our concerns are that there are going to be too many predators in the reservoir and that it might, uh, uh, those predators might consume too many of the rainbow and cutthroat and actually cause a collapse of that fishery. Uh, the fishery is really important, um, not only for the reservoir itself, but the uh, rainbow and cutthroat that are in the reservoir annually run up the North Fork of the Shoshone River and um, provide uh, anglers opportunities up there as well. The North Fork of the Shoshone River is known nationally and internationally by anglers, many of them tourists. A Creel survey from 2008 documented anglers from 45 of the 50 states as well as several foreign countries. The illegal introduction of walleye to Buffalo Bill, which occurred as early as 2003, poses a dual threat to the trout species in the reservoir. Walleye prefer shallow waters, lake trout prefer deeper parts of the reservoir. And so our fear is that uh, being that we have these shallow water predators like walleye and deep water predators like lake trout, there's going to be very few places that are um, rainbow and cutthroat are going to find that uh, they can escape from, from those uh, predators. Um, rainbow and cutthroat won't entirely go away, but they will, they will like, it's quite possible that they could go away to the point where they're unavailable to anglers. The Game and Fish will continue to manage against walleye in Buffalo Bill Reservoir. Beginning in 2014, walleye will be considered a non-game fish in that reservoir. And the current regulation allowing for unlimited harvest of walleye will change to a must-kill regulation, requiring any walleye caught in Buffalo Bill Reservoir to be killed. With lake trout, anglers can keep up to six fish with only one more than 24 inches. This is Ray Hageman with the Wyoming Game and Fish Department.